Legends, welcome back to another episode of where I test every single vehicle that I can find in Forza Horizon 4. The vehicle I'm testing today is a 1969 Dodge Charger Daytona Hemi. Classic. You guys ever watched ca Cars? Yeah. <laughs> You'll understand. Alrighty. So, uh, yeah, it's uh, Class C, 595, so top tier. Very o almost like five points away from max tier Class C rear wheel drive engine sits in the front let's see how it stacks up against the rest of the vehicles so it does kind of look like the Dodge Charger road track but just with a special light fixture in the front um, yeah interesting you'll see what I mean when you see the, see the rear of it and it's got a massive wing at the back massive but yeah well loud engine, revs nice and high, but ah, it's nice and quick, it's much more, much more awake than the standard Charger RT. It does feel kind of heavy, and a lot longer even though it won't be that much longer. It is quick. It's almost like a mixture between the Dart and the Charger RT. So the tires aren't that amazing, but it's not too bad. doesn't feel quite as responsive. It does feel a little bit heavier for sure. But I think it, it is probably quite a bit faster than the standard RT. some nice backfires. Alright, let's see the interior view. It's nice. It's very similar to the, um, the Charger RT. It's just a different steering wheel, I see. So it only has four gears. <laughs> yeah, and it's quick. Tires, 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 tires. Interesting logo on the, the steering wheel, eh? Reminds you a little bit of a Mercedes Benz. <laughs> According to the tachometer on the dashboard, I am definitely using the red line real estate. <laughs> but I'm actually just using a little bit of the actual real estate on the digital tech. Oh well. It's a big vehicle. Very cool. 314.4, so it's probably just a little bit quicker, two seconds or something like that, than the Charger RT. As far as I can remember. My memory's not that good. Anyway. It is what it is. Okay, so let's see how it performs on the cross country. Circuit. I can't say that I like the front of the vehicle. It's like, it's not really pretty. 
This is my opinion. It's a little odd. But it is more aerodynamic, I guess. It's certainly awake, that's for sure. Feels okay. Haven't really turned much with it. Ooh, it's sliding a bit. That's not too bad. Concentrating, that's so why I'm not really talking much. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not as not as quick as I expected it to be, but it certainly handles a little bit better than the standard RT, I'd say. But it is a bit more like rough around the edges. Ooh, that was a crazy collision. Oopsie. Ah, oh, man, got the <laughs> view thing wrong. It's just on that critical part of the turn, you know? We're still in the lead, we're okay. <laughs> pretty vehicle, I mean, it's, it's pretty cool with a gigantic wing. Spaceship, you know, reminds me of Thunderbird 2. <laughs> you ever watch that film? Thunderbirds? Thunderbirds are monetized. <laughs> Thunderbird 2. <laughs> there we go. I should have painted the car green. <laughs> yeah, it's quick. It's really doing well on the cross country circuit. Take the Charger RT, put a big wing on it, and make it a little bit more powerful, and there you go. You can win the race. <laughs> 324.1 on the mark, I'd say. It's pretty good. All right. Let's see how it does on the drag strip. Mm hmm. Curious to see what the top speed is. Is it actually quicker than the Charger RT? Hmm. Let's find out. Have a look at the middle of the screen. There's a tree that'll suddenly change shape. Did you see that? <laughs> Fun fact. Little glitch. All right. Let us drive. Doesn't really give us much real estate in the red line to play with. 
But wow, look at this thing take off. It needs another gear. Come on. Only four gears. It's at the same top speed as the RT, a little bit slower, right? A little bit slower. It's four kilometers per hour. <laughs> There goes the RT. <laughs> we'll catch him. There you have it. Lucky, I'd say. 117.1. Is that slightly slower? It must be. Than the Charger RT. One second. Hmm. <laughs> there you go. There you have it. But I bet if you put five gears in it, it'll eat up the Charger RT. Quickly. Anyway. Will it drift? Yes. That's a burnout nicely. Mm -hmm. Nicely done. Second gear, third gear. Let's go for third gear, see if they do anything. Hey! A little something. It struggles a little. It's a heavy vehicle. Let's go for second gear here. Much better, much easier to initiate the drift. Let's see. It's not very quick to respond, so you have to be a little bit careful. Let's go for second gear again. Try third gear again. Hey, 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 without the handbrake. Oh, it does struggle a little bit there. It needs more power. Alrighty guys, there you have it. This has been the 1969 Dodge Charger Daytona Hemi. Classic. Like the video if you liked it, subscribe if you want to support the channel, that would be awesome. And com comment your thoughts below on this vehicle. Does it look like Thunderbird 2? Your opinion matters. Alrighty. So, <laughs> as always, thanks for watching guys. All the best, see you in the next one. Peace.